here. I hope you're doing amazing today. So, um, I had a part two of my video. Um, when should I have kids? And it got completely deleted. I have no idea where it went. So I just want to re-record this part. Um, I'm sorry if I repeat anything from the first kind of... I was gonna call it an episode, but the first video. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to um, tell you guys a little bit more about that subject. So I kind of covered um, how my husband and I decided to like physically start trying to have kids. Um, but I wanted to cover how we came to the decision um, mentally, spiritually, all that kind of stuff um, to decide to have kids. I did a lot of research trying to figure out what's the best age to have kids, um, what do you need to have to have kids, how much do you need to make, like your budgets and everything like that. Um, I did a lot of that stuff and really reading through articles and everything, the thing that I took from all of it is if you have a safe place for the baby to stay and to sleep, um, you have food for them, you have clothing for them, they're gonna have all their basic necessities, they're in a safe, caring, loving environment, you and your partner are in a safe and stable relationship um, where you can take care of the child and of course you can be a single parent and choose to do it that way but as long as you feel mentally and physically ready um, for that journey, as long as you have just enough money um, to feel comfortable and everything, then I'd say go for it. Of course I'm not going to say like if you're 14 or something wanting to have a child, um, it's going to be a lot harder for you. Sure, like it's definitely possible um, and if you're in that situation, you can definitely go through it and still have a wonderful life. But I'm talking about like ideals if you're trying to find the perfect time um, to have children. I, th I personally I feel any time in your 20s or above, um, even like 18 or whatever, as long as you feel like you're ready in your heart um, and you feel like you can handle it and you're doing it for the right reasons, it's not to keep a guy, it's not because you're lonely, um, anything like that, it's because you are yearning to be a mother and this is a life goal for you, you really want to raise a child and you want to teach them everything and you want to care for them and help them become a wonderful human being, then you're. I think you're definitely ready and you should go for it. I think there's a lot of anxiety with starting to try for kids and just when to do it and when's the best time and from everything I've heard from people, articles, everything, it's just you'll never be completely ready and you just have to go with your gut and then learn along the way because even if you're completely, absolutely set up, you're in the best circumstances ever to have a child, um, you can still be completely thrown off kilter <laughs> because it's such a life-changing experience. Um, so you just have to prepare, be in the right headspace. Um, yeah, and that's about it. I just wanted to tell you guys that that's how we came across, or that's how we decided to start having kids. Um, you just have to follow your heart, have those basic necessities for the child, um, and as long as everyone's happy and safe and prepared for that kind of thing, then I'd say go for it. <laughs> so that is just my two cents if anyone's kind of struggling with the idea of when to have kids. Um, for me personally, I wanted to have kids at 27. I'm 27 now, so I still have like half a year or so um, to get pregnant <laughs> um, to meet my like arbitrary goal, but um, I'm hoping that it'll happen pretty soon. Um, not that that matters too much, that was just kind of like my ideal thing I always kind of told myself. Um, but yeah, so 25, um, I think it's 25, 27 is usually the prime baby making age sort of thing. And after that and before that, there can be some complications um, with getting pregnant, but that is not to say that it's not possible, it definitely is possible. Um, 
but yeah, that's like what I've heard from my fertility doctor. That's the prime age. So yeah. <laughs> I also just wanted to add that it's also super important that your partner and you are on the same page about having kids. It's never a good idea to surprise someone unless it's like a complete accidental pregnancy, which is totally fine. But I mean, like if you're planning on having a baby and they're unaware, that's never a good idea. It's not very healthy for the relationship or good for the baby um, to be in that situation. But um, just make sure that you and your partner have open communication, um, that if you have any worries or issues or anything that you can talk about it, talk through it, just be open and honest and uh, work through it together. Be very mature about it kind of thing. Um, and like with my husband and I, we talked about kids from the very beginning, from one of our very first conversations, and we both really, really want to have family and have kids and it's extremely important to us um, and we wanted to get married first which was our choice um, it's totally up to you if you want to have kids before marriage or not get married at all all that kind of stuff um, yeah but we personally wanted to wait till we get married then we waited a few months um, to make sure we were in a good mental place um, to get ready to do it and then yeah then we decided to start trying so um that's how we kind of came to the decision um together but we did have a lot of anxiety about what will people think um and all that i think i talked about that in my last video but like there was a lot of pressure where it's like you have to have a really good paying job, you have to own a big house, you have to have all this crazy stuff in order to have a kid, and it's not true. <laughs> it really isn't. Um, as long as you're safe, you're stable, you have enough room for a kid, um, you can give them a good life and all that, then you're all good. <laughs> so yeah, we were worried about judgment um, from our families but but our families actually have been incredibly amazing and supportive um, overall there have been a few people that are kind of um, didn't react as we would have hoped but they've come around um, <laughs> and it's our life and we want to have kids and we are at the age that we feel ready to have kids um, and yeah so it's completely up to you just follow your heart your family will understand that that is what you need to be happy in your life so yeah that's just my two cents about it and I hope it helps you guys um, make your own decision about when to have kids <laughs> I hope that helps um, you guys those are just my two cents you're welcome to leave your own opinions down in the comments please always be polite as always um, everybody has their right to their opinions and everything but yeah if you decide to have children, best of luck to you um, and you're welcome to check out some of my videos on trying to conceive and see what we've done so far and what's helped. Um, yeah, I might do a video coming up soon just explaining the basics, what you need to know about trying to conceive. Um, and if you want me to do that, please let me know in the comments and like the video and I'll be sure to upload that as soon as I can. Thanks so much for watching guys. I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.